Praise the Lord. Emmanuel. We are Mr. and Mrs. Uh, Fidelis Chukuka from Delta State. The problem that brought us here is child problem. For the past 15 years, we've, we've not gotten any issue. We've gone to different places, different doctors. They said that I'm having low spend count and my wife irregular menstruation. I watch Emmanuel TV almost every day. I ask questions on how I will come here. Some people wouldn't want to tell you the truth. It will look as if you are going to America. But I was lucky to meet one of my friends and he told me that coming here is easy. So by May last year, I came here, I received anointing water. In fact, I came here with faith. See man of God alone in person. You are covered if you believe. When I crossed the road to come and easy myself, I saw the man with a short necker and uh, uh, this uh, canvas. I never knew his t uh, Professor TV, Joshua. He looks very simple. It was people that said, this is the Emmanuel TV they are talking about. In fact, he's a very simple man. I expect him to put bigger butter and the rest of them as a, as a, a big man. But it was with short necker. When I came on May, I took the anointing water back to my place. I told my wife I'm back, and this is the last stop that we must succeed. We prayed together, we met as man and wife. Surprisingly, by June, she said uh, it's like uh, she's missing a period. By June, just June, then he went to the hospital, came back with the uh, results. They said it's uh, positive. In the next month, he went again. They said the same, but they asked her one question. Are you still marrying the same man you are marrying before? He said, yes, that he has no other husband than the very man. They say, you're got strong to have endured. But I have the faith that we must have issue. So today, if you can see, my wife is pregnant. Man of God, I thank you very much. Uh, very soon, we'll come back here to give testimony and show our baby. Thank you. Praise the Lord. Emmanuel. Standing here is uh, Mr. and Mrs. Uh, Fidelis Chukoka from Delta State. The problem that brought us here is uh, the problem of uh, barrenness. 15 years barrenness. I came here in June last year. And after Collecting the anointing water, I went back to Delta State and met my wife. I told her that I've gone to the last bus stop. We prayed and uh, administered the anointing water. After one month, my wife missed her period. My problem that brought me here is uh, because of loose pen count and uh, irregular menstruation. That was what the doctors said. So we've gone to many places, like you know, somebody who has such problem. I went to many places. I almost eat what I wouldn't eat to make sure we have issue. Until God sent somebody that directed me to this place. When I came here alone, June last year, I collected the anointing water. And when I got home, we prayed, we administered it. So after one month, my wife took in. I thought it was a joke. She went to the hospital and the doctors confirmed that it's pregnancy. After three, four months, I came back here to give my testimony that my wife is now pregnant. You can see inside this uh, anointing water booklet, I and my wife are in the center page here when she was there. Uh, pregnant. Today, I'm here to thank God that this pregnancy has resulted to this boy, victory. Emmanuel. Emmanuel. My name is uh, Teresa Chukoka. 
This is my husband. Already my husband has said it all. I want to thank God for my life and my life of my family. Mrs. Yinka Olofintoye came to the Synagogue Church of All Nations seeking the face of Jesus Christ. Her medical report proffers the doctor's diagnosis, along with the x-rays, of the damage her system has sustained. A stiff neck due to cervical spondylosis, for which she had used a neck collar for three years. Her confidence was for a total and radical transformation in the name of Jesus Christ at the Synagogue Church of All Nations prayer line. Prophet T.B. Joshua ministers prayer in the powerful name of Jesus Christ. Let's watch what happens next. Man of God, help me. I can't turn my neck. Please, due to cervical spolidosis. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ, Prophet T.B. Joshua stretches his right hand, as instructed in the book of Acts, chapter 4, verse 20, to proclaim healing and freedom in Mrs. Olofintoye's life. Immediately under the restorative influence of the Holy Spirit, she topples off her chair as the Spirit of God moves through her body. The man of God instructs the neck collar to be removed as she has been set free. Thank you, Jesus. I suffered from this problem over three years ago. Thank you, Lord. I can turn my neck now. Thank you, Jesus. I can bend down now. Thank you, Lord. Before, I cannot bend down. Ah, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Sometime later, Mrs. Olofintoy came back to the Synagogue Church of All Nations to testify to the goodness of God in her life. My name is Nyanka Olofintoy. The problem that brought me to the Synagogue Church of All Nations is the stiff neck. By then, I'm using neck collar. The doctor diagnosed that I have a stiff neck, the cervical spondylosis, at least for five years. I'm using this collar. Okay, for that five years, can you tell us what your experience was like? How did this problem uh, affect your daily life? What were you passing through? Hmm. By then, it's a real problem because I cannot walk. I cannot do anything. Pains all over. My head, my neck, I cannot drive. I cannot do anything. Immediately, the man of God stretched his hand on me. I received my healing. I'm okay. I can turn my neck anywhere. I can turn it as you have seen it now. So since then, I can drive now. I can wash my clothes, everything in the home. I can do it now. So I thank God. Thank God with you. We congratulate you for this wonderful healing you have received. And tell us. When the man of God stretched his hand towards you and you fell off the chair, can you share your experience with us at that point in time? Well, by that time, in fact, I don't know anything. I know that the man of God came to me. Immediately he stretched his hand. I can see that one. Immediately I fell down. So I don't know what's happened. When I stood up, I can see that I'm free. No more pain, no more stiff neck. I can turn my neck immediately. So since then, I'm happy. Okay, now can you just demonstrate, can you turn your neck to the east, to the west, north, south, and bend down? Uh, so, you, you mean you couldn't do all this before? Uh, no, I cannot do it. My advice to my people is that they should believe in God. They should believe that all things are possible. So, God can do all things. So, whatever may be your problem, just come to God. God will heal you as he did my own. Thank you. 